Welcome back to my channel. Today we'll do question number second of exercise 1.2. Let's see a question. Its first part is write a pair of negative integers whose difference gives a. So we have to write a pair of negative integers whose difference gives us a. As we know that the difference of 10 and 2 is 8. Difference of 20 and 12 is 8. So we have many pairs whose difference is 8. But we have to take negative integers whose difference gives us positive 8. So how we'll take or how we'll arrange these integers so that we get their differences plus 8 or positive 8. So, to get the differences positive 8, we will take this greater number in second position. Why? Because when we we'll put them in the condition, let's see how. Minus 2 minus because we need difference minus 10. Why I said that we will take six, uh, greater integer on second because... When we will solve this, here this minus and minus will become plus which will give us our answer that is positive 8. So minus 2 plus 10, minus and minus here becomes 10. So minus 2 plus 10, here we will perform subtraction and our answer will be positive 8 as a greater integer is in positive. Same way we can do this also and many other pairs are there whose difference is 8. Now let's see our second part. Now our second part is write a negative integer and a positive integer whose sum is minus 5. We need a pair of such integers in which one of our integer is negative and other is positive and our final answer should be negative 5 or minus 5 by performing the operation addition. Now we know that we know that the difference of 10 and 5 is 5 difference of 20 and 15 is 5 and many other such pairs. So let's take this one pair to solve this question. Here we need a negative and a positive integer whose sum is minus 5. As I taught you earlier that the sign of final answer depends on the greater integer in our condition. So here we have two integers that is 10 and 5 and our greater integer is 10. So we will take 10 as negative integer and 5 as positive integer. So minus 10 as we need to perform addition, that is we need to find sum of the integers plus 5. So minus plus we will perform subtraction 5 and our answer will be minus 5. Why? Because our greater integer is in negative that is minus 10. So this, this is the pair by which we got our answer that is minus 5. Now let, let's see our third part. Now our third part is write a negative integer and a positive integer whose difference is minus 3. Now here we have to write a negative and a positive integer as same we have done in second part but there we need to find the sum and here it is asked to find the difference. difference. So now we know that 6 and 3, we can get the difference is 3, 5 or 2, 10 or 7 and many more pairs are there whose difference is. But when you take these pairs, you will not get minus 3. Why? I'll explain you. Here we need an integer that is a positive integer and we have to subtract or find the difference of it from a negative integer. So when you will take the negative integer here it will become minus and minus plus or 
if we write negative integer first and then take the its difference with positive integer then also we need a such pair where minus and minus will become plus that is we need a pair whose sum is 3 or we, then we'll get minus 3 so the pair whose sum is 3 is 2 and 1 this is the pair when we add this these integers we get 3 so now we will take one integer is negative and other integer is positive so if we take 2 and minus 1 let's see what our answer is so minus 1 we are taking a negative integer and we need to perform subtraction so this is the sign of subtraction and then plus 2 so here minus 1 plus minus becomes minus that is minus 2 so our answer here is minus 3 so this is how you will do your question number second.